Two decades on, this image of Boris Yeltsin remains the reference point for many remembering the failed coup against Soviet leader Mikhail Gorbachev. Yeltsin, the then president of Russia, led public resistance to the attempted takeover. Thousands protested against the coup announced 20 years ago today by leading hardline communists opposed to Gorbachev's reforms. With Gorbachev under house arrest at his Black Sea villa, armored vehicles were sent into Moscow. Yet amid public opposition, the putsch collapsed two days later. Gorbachev flew back to the capital, looking badly shaken by the experience. Many historians say the coup achieved the opposite of what the plotters intended and simply hastened the demise of the Soviet Union just months later.